It's a good morning to be alive, and we're here with Lugger TV. That's a good intro song. <laughs> I like that a lot. This is an exciting time. I'm glad you are here. Thank you for subscribing. If you keep up with the Lunkers TV channel, you already know the first spawners have been caught. I found some, and we're gonna find some more. Yes, we've been talking about this for what seems like, uh, yeah, 10 months, really. We did not really have a great spawn last year. We've been watching the weather consistently, watching the moon phases, and this year we're hitting it hard. So subscribe right here to the channels, because we're going hard, baby. March, April, May even, uh, we're gonna hit this spawn. We're gonna take you guys along for the adventure, but today, I'm hoping to get my first spawning fish off of that. I know where some are. I saved, I didn't foul mouth them. There's, there's a group of them I didn't, I didn't mess with. That's, I know where they're at. That's a special thing right there. Yeah. You see what he did? He called me yesterday and was <laughs> like, I found him, I found him, I found him. It's a magical moment when you see the first ones on the bed. Oh, it's um, crazy. And the so. thing was I drove, yesterday I drove on this lake more than I've driven in the past six, seven months because I was looking for water for today. And you found the juice, I found some the juicy juice. Let's start it off with a tip right now. Go ahead oh. and hit the like button. We had a bunch of rain come in, so everything north, all the creeks coming in are muddied up. They're muddied up. They're actually like two to three degrees cooler That's than good. the southern half of the lake. Everything else is clear on the southern half, and up there is like 57, 58. On the southern end, it's like 61 to 62. Whew. Calm conditions today. It's looking good, y'all. Booyah, it's gonna happen. Yeehaw. I can see Rob's ready. Rob's ready. Ready to fish. <laughs> He's got him ready. Dude, He's our, in the box. I know what I need. I'm only going to need like two different rods. We're not on peak moon phase for spawn, but we're on peak sight fishing conditions today. Put your sunscreen on. Put your buffs on. If you guys need one of these, exactly. uh, they'll be linked down below. The new Guggen. Let's brighten that up a little bit. The new Guggen. Uh, Topo. Uh, is that oh, yeah, it's a to oh. Guggen Topo. Oh, you need to grab one. I mean, they're right up here on the grass line. Yeah, this one. We're gonna leave that one alone. There he is. Right there. Mm -hmm. He's probably yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and rig up a T-Hoss rig. <laughs> That's so exciting to see, man. We're putting on a Texas rig. Now the thing is, what are we gonna put on there? What do you do? You can throw a lot of things in there, but to make life a little easier on yourself, throwing something bright that you can see is often the way to go. I've got some bright colored tubes in here. Chartreuse, pink. Those are all really good things to throw that you can see. Uh, 3 8 ounce weight here. Got that pegged. And I've got a uh, 4 aught uh, extra wide gap hook. You want to try to pick out a hook that is like right on the end of the bait essentially. These fish just love to nip the back end. I like it. I think there is some darkness in there. Yeah, yep, there is. There, there is. is. Yep. Looks like Do you it, see him right now? It went over in that corner. I think it went into that dark, dark patch right there. That one wasn't fired up. It wasn't a one wipe Charlie, you know? Update for you. The first fish has been seen. We've seen multiple fish. Cruisers, we've seen a couple of betters. We haven't seen a complete lock, but there's definitely catchable fish out here. It gets me pumped. It gets me so pumped. It's been a while since I've seen really clear water like this and then when you see those first cruises of the year, it's really exciting. That's my little search bait, my little the bait I throw when not sight fishing, basically. That's the bed fishing bait. If you don't have polarized lenses, you're pretty much screwed for sight fishing. That's one of the key essentials. Write that down. Okay, we got one. You see the bed? Oh, Push I definitely see the, see the bed. bed. I saw him, he swam this way. It's definitely 1,000% the male. I almost just kind of want to soak this in for a minute, you know? <laughs> so like, I could probably shoot my lure up and get him to bite right now but I'm kind of just enjoying watching him right now come on back and slurp it in okay surprising change of events uh, that fish never came back sometimes you think you know him one of these has got to be the bed oh there he is yeah he came back take a gander at it sir he's he's looking oh it's time to give it the old shimmy shimmy shake <laughs> He's he's uh he's nosing, but he's like at a distant nose. So he's gonna he's about to eat it now. That was literally what was happening. Come here, first sad fish of the year. Awesome. 
Come here. Love it. In your nose. In your nose, love it. That fish right there is pretty fresh looking. Not any marks of, you don't even see anything on the tail. He's very, very fresh. Looks good. That's a fresh spawner. And we're gonna put him right back in his hole. Good job, dude. Thank you. See you, baby. Here's what was going on right here. We have, we have a bed right there and a bed right there. And this is kind of that phase where the, when the fish first move up, he's like, I don't know if I want to be here or over here. And he was over here at the first spot and I threw in there and he didn't really, he would kind of come over to it, but he wouldn't really eat it. And then I threw in it over here. And then he comes over to the other side. And he's like, you know what? I feel like this is my home. I'm going to attack this thing. Can only go up from here. First bed fish of the year. We're going to take turns on the bed fishing. So Unless I got the first one. It's like a real big one. Then you can have it. Like okay. Sure. Kind of go, go back and forth. Um, so you guys could check both of our channels to watch some of the action. It's always good when you, you like know that it's happening and that it's fresh and it gives you more anticipation of oh, there could be more move up throughout the day. So we're learning, we're progressing. We're gonna keep it going and uh, hopefully we get a bigger one. You just put these on and you go down the bank and you look and you look for these sandy spots where the fish fan, they use their tails and they fan out areas. And since this is a grass lake, it's pretty obvious. There'll be these just sandy holes. Oh my, it is not moving. It is just not locked it's in locked. there. Got him. So satisfying. <laughs> a little bit of work. That was fun. We got it done. That was that was fun to watch. I hope you guys enjoyed watching that that <laughs> process go down. We kind of had a lot of angles going on there. Alrighty here. Here we go, guys. This is this this fish right here. I don't even think I've I've found the the juiciness yet. Uh, I flipped into a kind of a barren area, and there is a little male that just came shooting out. He is, ooh, he is on it right now. So weird how he's. He shouldn't have darted over here on that one. Oh, okay, caught, there he That's, is. I like it when it gets that little twig. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it doesn't like having a little twig stuck to your bait. <laughs> Pretty one, weird. 20 minutes early. Pretty weird. Yeah, 20 minutes early could be timing. He's coming back. Hard stare, hard stare right now. The vibration. Oh wow, there it is. There it yep. is. Oh, he's like breathing. Oh, oh, oh. oh he's got it. Ooh. Oh. 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 He got it. Yep. He got it. Got him. Yeah. That's a beaut. And there's the zinger of the day. Hey, I'm, I'm feeling real confident now that those other ones might have moved up. Yeah. There we go. That's a thing of beauty, folks. Thing of beauty. Look at that I'm beautiful. You want to you help me out here? Yes. Oh, right nice. Right in the, right in the, oh. I like to see him just nose oh. like that. Look at oh. that fresh one. Yes. <laughs> I want to give him a sniff as well. That's a really pretty, pretty, yeah, pretty grainy, golden man. fish. Love it. <sighs> ah, love you, baby. Okay. And, uh, See ya. Go back to your home. Look where it goes. Just time to get him another one. There's a banana peel. Yeah, you can see in here we're really good. There's one. Oh, it's a bar. There's one. That, that's a, oh yeah, that's a bass. Yeah, where's he going? He's going, going right. He's chasing the gar off. Yeah, when you move it right there, he's like, he it's all about it. <laughs> oh, dude, he looked right at the lens. 
<laughs> He's like, I see you recording me. He, like, he likes the hard pop. The hard pop. Oh gosh, it's so cool. Oh gosh, that was cool. That was cool. Nice fish, man. Nice fish. Really cool. Switched up baits right there, guys. This this thing has like a crazy tail on it. So you just give it a little pop and it just flares and it kind of it re makes them react to it, kind of freaks them out. But oh my gosh. That was fun to watch. Yes. My gosh. What's a gar? No, it's two gar. There's another bass. And a bass. Oh, whoa. Yeah, he came back See how this behavior is weird? There's bass. a bass fighting yeah. off a gar. What the heck? There's fish here, right there. Oh, yeah. That's oh. a bigger one. Yeah, that one's in a broad area. But oh, there's two more right here. That's a big one. Oh, yep. my God. Okay. That's, That's a locked? locker. That's, That's a locked. locker with a male. That's probably a six or a seven with like okay. a two. I'm going to turn around. <laughs> uh, we went from four foot to 12 foot. Uh huh and tons of grass. Oh my God, there's another one right there too. <laughs> there's another one right there. All righty. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, there's one. under the dock there? Yeah. Did you one. see that yes, one? Yes, I did. That's the one that was just That's right That's a large here. one. It was just right here on the front of this. I, just I think pole. you just put the pole down in yeah, the bed, I dude. <laughs> you, probably just, you probably just stabbed him. <laughs> so many fish everywhere. There, 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 there. Jam the freaking poles down. Wow, I see that fish. That's but, not a small one. I know, dude. That's what I'm saying. I there's do a, see a little fish right there. There's a little one, but there's also a big one. Yeah, there's a big one mixed in. Hey, uh, the thing yeah, is, when you set the hook, you're not nope, going to know. I just had him on. You just had him on. Swam with it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it was a leaf. This cloud cover. It's killing the game in a bad way. These fish, we have thrown up weightless baits, all sorts of baits up shallow. We've watched tons of fish cruising. They don't eat. And you really get to see this happen in this clear water. They get up, they get ready to spawn, they start thinking about it, they cruise the banks, and they're, they got one thing on their mind. You know what that is, spawning, not eating. So we're literally targeting the, the fish that are just being protective, super hard. We have not gotten a bite on fish that are just roaming, cruising. With cloud cover makes it really tough. We're gonna try to push back into a little bit more shallower area uh, where the fish probably aren't gonna be as big. Bigger fish always spawn a little bit deeper where your eye just loses sight of the bottom. That cloud cover right there is, is really hurting us on trying to target those bigger ones out deep. We're gonna get another one for you guys. Stay tuned. Oh, 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 you got two fish. Yeah, I do. You got two fish. Thought I just laced one oh, on that drop. Hold on, hold on. He, he's looking at it. Move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Yep, he's about to take it. He's yep. about to take it. He's about to take it. That's not a bad fish. He's going to take it. That's, yeah, that's okay. going to be a done deal. Yeah, a done I think it's time to refire. Yeah. Isn't it funny how we both bed fish differently? You sit there and look like you're like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm going a little hard on that technique. <laughs> Like right off the bat, usually <laughs> it, like, it kind of depends on the fish. the fish. Females on the right, male is on the left. Got a weird glare, I can still see. Okay, time to do a little switch here. I'm gonna put on something a little bit more um, action-esque. Yeah, I threw up in this little bed at first, couldn't see the fish. Thought I saw just kind of something. And then uh, the old big lurker. Just came out. I, I would assume the, the south side of that thing is really what they like. You see her just keep turning. The male is just, he's just locked. He's doing. Oh, oh. She around. likes it on the right. She's rolling. Oh, just saw her belly. She's just rolling. She's doing the belly roll. Right. Wow. Damn. It's about to be over. She likes it right there. That's the key. Dude, my heart's literally just, just, like my. <clears throat> get it in there. I, oh God, I love this so much. She's on the right side. Just she's so locked. Oh, she took it. I'm shaking, man. I'm shaking like a leaf. Oh God, that's why I do this. 
I love this so much. Give us a good. Got her. Got her. Yeah. Got her. Got her. Oh yeah. There you go. Buddy. Oh yeah. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish. <laughs> that is fun, man. That is fun. Dun, 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 dun. Give it a good old oh, hey, there's my wall. How about it? How about that? How about them apples? Ah. <sighs> you got to love it. <sighs> Sucked it. I love it. I love it when you can watch it happen like that. So cool. Fishing freaks. That's what it's all about. That was fun. See ya. Fresh move uppers. Male still locked. He never even attempted. That female though, she was pissed that the male was not doing his job. She was like, if you ain't gonna do this, I'm gonna do it. No, he came back. No, to yeah, 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 he's right on it. He's right on it. Yep. Oh, he whipped, he whipped. Yep. Oh, 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 God, got him, got him, got him, got him. Yeah. Yes. Yes. That was not an easy one. End of the day, Rob's ending it on the on a nice one. He caught the last one of the day. Shadows are getting weird. Sight fishing time's over. Don't fear though, if you like this action, there's gonna be a lot more to come in this next couple months. We're gonna be going on a tour. We're gonna be doing a, a Texas tour of some of the grass lakes. And hopefully you can take this kind of stuff to your local place and use it in the next few months. <clears throat> or right now, just depending on where you are. But I gotta tell you, when a big buck walks under your stand, you get that heart thump. This is kind of the same thing for me. There's there's really only two things in the outdoors that get me super jazzed up. That's um, you know close up bow hunting and this right here when you can actually see the fish, especially when it's a big one. This was a great warm up day uh, to get ready, kind of get my skills honed, get the old Texas rigs honed in, get the action, just get the feel. You learn something from every fish that you watch. That's what I really love about sight fishing so ain't nothing like it baby go subscribe to lunkers to see more of the fish catching action today and the future action that is to come y'all subscribe right here to this channel and if you want to check out some of the sweet gear like this texas rig hat link is down in the description i appreciate you very much and we will see you on the next one <laughs>